What's up guys? We are on our way to the Catfish Conference 2021. Um, earlier this year in February, they did a Catfish Conference 2021 where it was virtual. This one we get to go here in Kansas City, Missouri, which is about 20 minutes where we live. And this so, Catfish KC, we're going to the Catfish KC Conference. I mean, Catfish Kansas City. But it's it's, a, it's the, the Catfish right? Conference in KC. So hey. we're we're also excited. It's not virtual this year. Um, it's in person, but there are they are still They're doing it virtual too. They are still doing doing it virtual for people that can't make it. Um, but we're excited to go. Convention center, baby. Yeah, it would. Here. All right. In the parking garage. Ben, you feeling good? How was that Chick Fil A, buddy? Dude, that was freaking delicious. Hit the spot. The spot. It hit the spot. Nice. It was spot on and it hit it, that spot. Nice so, day of walking around the, the convention center. He is. I need to find a bathroom. I drank a lot of water and coffee this morning. Oh, oh I need some coffee. Oh, oh. Nicholas. Need, they probably have some refreshments and beverages here. We'll see. We'll see about that. Mm. Let's go see what's up. Uh, we've already already seen people buying uh, buying rods and and uh, carrying them to their car. Seems like we, we haven't even made it inside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here comes a slime. I think it's a slime cat. A slime? I think it's a slime cat rod. We'll ask him about it. Looks like a lightsaber from here. <laughs> it does. This is for us. All right. It's beautiful down here. Here's the convention center. That's one cat. Yeah. Bumper bumper rod. Bumper Looks awesome. How's it going, guys? All right. Got to pull these tickets up. Oh, thank you, sir. No photography allowed. We're going. We got in. How you doing? Just playing plenty good. <laughs> All right, starting to get a little louder up here. Catfish Conference 2021. It's kind of cool. Look at that. How open it is. How's it going? Good to see all this stuff here. Yeah, it is. Catfish KC, huh? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Just, we, we started a YouTube channel. Just a small ourselves. channel here in Kansas. Uh, yeah, here in Kansas and Missouri. Yeah. yeah, a lot on the Kansas. Yeah. Mostly Kansas. All right, guys, we made it inside the conference. Check out these anchors. Wait, is these actually, are these actual Sea Arc anchors? Looks like it's made by Sea Arc. That's genius. I need I need one of these anchors. I almost I was floating down the Missouri backwards just this last year. It scared me so bad. Um, definitely would need one of these. Aluminum, pretty heavy duty right there. Look at the handle on it. The handles. I like it. How much is it? That one's going for two hundred and twenty dollars. Wow. I mean, it's probably gonna. It's probably gonna. It's probably gonna last you a Check long out time. Slime rocks over here. I've oh, seen a lot about them. We've always wanted to try them, but I don't know. Is one of us gonna walk away with one today? Slime rods. I want. I want to look at them. I want. To, I want to check them out a little bit. Known for their, known for their color and how they illuminate um, under black light or any of these kind of lights. It's got slime cat. I've actually. I've actually never been able to actually feel one of these.
definitely known for their different colors. He's um, he's got so he's got so many um, different assortments of rods, different colors, different types for different things. If you didn't catch him last year on uh, the virtual conference, um, looks like he's got a lot more this year too. But I would suggest go back and watch that as well. These. So, see what Nick thinks about this. Nick, what do you think about it? Uh, honestly, Look at this. so this eyelet right here. The, yeah. the big eyelets, and they're really, yeah. they're epoxied in, they're really solid on there. So those are good. Uh, here's what I feel. Like. It's probably more, it's, it's probably it, it's, more for it feels, a spinner. It feels pretty, uh, it's like a medium heavy so it feels, so. I've seen. Uh, here, here's what I'll say. My whisker seeker feels like a tip, it's very light. It's more like a fast action tip, so it's, Gets really sensitive bites. So this feels like bigger fish, kind of. Cool. Yeah. Last year in his uh, last year with his virtual the virtual conference last year, he explained he was going to be coming out with a lot more um, bumping rods, a lot more even I think for other fish species, um, stripers, everything. So look at how, how how tall is that rod right there? Is that 12, 12 foot? Twelve foot. Now, I wonder if these are for spinning reels because of the... I think it's a one-piece, too. The eyelets. No, it's a two-piece. Yeah. Remember his two-piece go in... His two-piece kind of go in the opposite way. Let's see if Whisker Seeker's around. A lot of action at the Slime Cat Rod booth, though. Hey. Definitely. Oh, this is the Slime... Slime Line. Slime Line. Got 30-pound, 40-pound all mono tell me what this looks like i mean it looks like aside from the right here with the housing and everything abu garcia 6500 mm -hmm. um i think that i mean he's even talked about that as well these are some of the ones he was showing last year on the virtual conference so i wonder wonder what what is the 103 which one's the 103 fifth um, is that these these two these, two, oh, these, these the same model One's right hand and one's left hand. Oh, gotcha. Oh, we should have noticed that right off. <laughs> Different green, too. Look. A little bit. Kind of. Oh, look at that. Huh. Have you guys been busy? Yeah. Like, it looks like I, we've, well, just walking in here, we see a lot of yeah, slime cat rods <laughs> going by. You can't miss them. Nope, they're pretty. Uh... <laughs> yeah, you definitely can't miss them. The lime green rods. Yeah. You guys got a huge selection, too. Yes, we have a lot of different rods. For... Each rod has, like, Three different uh, weights to it, so there's a lot of different options. Yeah. I just we, came out with the uh, ice fishing rods just for at the show. See, that's what the cool, cool thing is. He was talking about last year on the virtual conference. He was talking about like coming out with even more than just catfishing rods, right. which yeah, is really cool. Bass rods that are we're uh, working on. These are actual bass rods too. Yeah. yeah. And then I think he said something about crappie too. We have crappie rods. You got here. crappie we rods. Have medium light, ultra light, and medium, and those. Oh, nice. Um, and they're available. Wow. Is it? Is that what's? Oh, that's catch the fever. Catch the fever. Now here's the meat hunter. So here's meat hunter. We've we've heard a lot about them. These are these are meat hunter. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. Look at the get close. I know. What's the material is that? I don't. What is it covered in? Drift socks. All, all year long, all the reels have been sold out. So look at well, that's why. That's why a lot of people are going to take advantage and buy. Seven thousand C three series. Can't miss. Can't miss that clicker. <laughs> that wake you up, make you almost fall out of the boat. Is that a pen? Yeah. That's yeah. A, pens always. Have see, fun. pens. Pens. One thing that I've always kind of wanted to try, yeah. but. They're, like they're usually thing. out, especially this last year, like reels have been hard to come by. Um, lot poles, anything really. Got yeah, general tackle. These flip flops, shoes, sandals. Are those flip flops? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Crappy sandals. And affordable. $13.99. That's kind of cool, man. Dude, that would be fun. They, these, they're these terribly flip, uncomfortable, I'm sure. <laughs> they'd be they would really be uncomfortable, but we'd, Ben's, birth, Ben's uh, Christmas present, I think. It, we could get to the long trail that that'd be yeah look at those light flower the lights on the, the front 
Where's the other little They got blood pops. Yeah. 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 And then, so, 22 schedule will be out soon. Um, next yeah. tournament is Lexington, December 4th. Yeah. For all That's American. Weeks. Yeah. 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 Two weeks. And Week then we the have time. a tournament um, at El Dorado over here around Wichita, Kansas. What, 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 awesome. what time of year? Uh, May. It's going to be May 14th this year. Yeah, I think I've seen it. Yeah. Is that this right here? Yeah. So that's all American. Okay. And then our this tournament. This is really That's for the May 14th. Yep, May 14th. We do a charity tournament um, every year, benefiting children's birthdays. Awesome. And we're doing a raffle for the Hellcat. So we about to get into some tournaments now. Is there stuff a raffle to win this boat? Oh, <laughs> they're a raffle to win this right here. Oh man. Oh man, dude. Just the the grit on that. Like you're not. You're, it's like you're walking walking on the, a rough beach, but I like it. Look at that front. You can do all the things you do all the time. Run into walls. And like <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't hit stuff at all. I don't know what he's talking about. So we talk about the Venturi in the air. So look at this picture. You don't see it with the naked eye. Mm -hmm. but, but the bu bubbles in there are so microscopic. It even like co it covers the wall, the tank, the bait. It just saturates the water with and here's the thing the air that we breathe is 19 to 21 percent that's the same going into this water so you don't overcook you don't over you cannot over oxygenate your bait yeah unlike using a medical grade oxygen tank or what have you yeah because you can be at risk at that if you don't know how to manage that so we've even had dissolved oxygen tests on this to find that even on the warmer water because your colder water retains that do mm -hmm. Even if it's not being retained because it's warmer, it doesn't matter because it's constantly being infused back into the water. So it's allowed you to get away with warmer water on those summer days versus what you have with most of the now. Because cooler water is going to have more oxygen. Yeah, in it. Yeah. yeah. So even if it dissolves right away, it's okay. Because a tank like that, like that 50 or 35, <clears throat> if you're running both pumps, those are 800 gallon per hour, you literally. 100% of all that water is run through that filter every five to 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. That's how constant. I guess it is. I'm gonna give you Nick. Man. You're Nick? Yeah. I'm Spencer. Spencer, good to meet you. Matt, Spencer. nice to meet you. Matt, we, we started a channel last year, a little tiny one called Catfish Yeah. You're, you're out in uh, Des Moines, right? Correct. It's like, what? Was it like a three hour drive from here? Give or take. Hey, which, which conference was that you, that you you came in with your camera and you Every just came? Like you came in and you started and like you just like meeting people like questions. you were yeah. like us just meeting people. That was my first exposure to you, man. Was it really? Yeah. And that that's like kind of like right two or three now. years ago. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We, Nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Dude, we love watching. You're Definitely. In a cool area to catfish. Like I've been. You've been on the Kansas yeah. before, or you talking about within the Missouri? Both. Both. Like you're in an area where you have both. That's yeah. the cool part. You know, you got two awesome rivers, mm -hmm. and then you're not that far from like. Perry, Clinton, mm -hmm. Yeah, Milf we still have yet to be to Milford, which is I was kind of there Wednesday and Thursday and after that front roll through it was really uh, Was it was that the day it was like windy and cold? cold and northwest wind. Northwest, yeah. yeah. I don't do very well on the reservoirs when you get post front with the northwest. Were you on the kayak? No, uh, okay. there's a guy who runs a guide service, two Nolan's guide service. Yep, yep. You heard yeah, of him. And Chase uh, mm -hmm. was nice enough to, to take me. This, this year has been, well, actually the summer was pretty good out here, but when you have more consistent weather, yeah. yeah. when you have fall and winter, you have like more fresh air, and when it's yeah. good, it's good, and when it's bad, it's bad. Summer, it's a little more even too. Yeah. 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 Well, Kansas River is pretty shallow river, and it's anyway. rock. Yeah. I'm Ben, by the way. I'm like Ben. Ben, nice to meet you, man. Good to meet you, man. Yeah. I don't know about that Pittsburgh hat, but I'll talk. Yeah. <laughs> it was a gift for my brother, and I like the hat. So. I'm, a, so. I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a Royals fan, so. so. I can get on board with that. Yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> They're like lifelong losers that finally won a World Series. Finally, yeah, dear God. Yep. Oh, yeah, well, you know all about that, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> You're empathetic to teams like that. What kind of cameras do you use? Um, I switched up a little bit. I got a Sony, I think it's like a... SV1 or SX1 or something like that, and that's kind of like my little bit higher resolution camera. Um, I had been using like a 5, so 
side. My B roll kind of upside camera show takedowns. Yeah. I kind of like ditched that and started using that Sony for that recently. And then I have a 9 that I got this spring. Before that, it was all 5. I, I would just look up Sony vlog camera. I can't remember what the, the letters are. It's like SB1, SX1. So you say it's just a little bit like little bit bigger than it's, like, it's probably legitimately like 1.8 times bigger. Like 1.8? Give or take yeah, point yeah, one. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, about, uh, like, Definitely not quite two times bigger. <laughs> what about like weather when you're dealing with like rain? Or it's not waterproof. No. You put a bag over, you just no. cut it off. Just cut it off. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> just, well, with the external microphone on the nine, it ain't waterproof either. Oh, I can do it. So I'll like punch over, you yeah. know, if I'm all I fish in the rain, I'm like <laughs> trying to block the rain. You wear a big hat. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> Well, you do a lot of camping too. That's oh yeah, I love it. Yeah. Nice. yeah we should link well, up I, sometime. Because I, I, I look at all your spots and I'm like, man, you have plenty of river. <laughs> you don't hear that ever, do you? Come on, actually, make me Mr. Flores. I like the idea of documenting and not creating. Like you just document what happens. And I try my best not to put up any skunk videos. I've done it like one or two times. But then you just make it about the journey. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's all about. That's really what people. Like, YouTube awesome. like you for. Yeah. I mean, some, they like you not, for you, right? I mean, it's not some really, do. Some people hate me, but, well, that's, but that's, that's, that's okay. But it's also it's fun. Yeah. That's what I'm exposing yourself out to do. <laughs> It'd be hard to lose something like this. It would. You can even find that one in the dark. <laughs> That's true. It's got black light paint That's on true. it. It's <laughs> true. Oh, Ma Mondo Cat. Okay. Yep. Yeah, I've heard of you guys. Definitely. These are all our holes. We make them ourselves. It's the Monster Rod Holder booth. We Yeah, we just got here a little bit late, so we got here about an hour ago. There you go. But... Now you're here. Yeah. The infamous. <laughs> this is a single action. Single action. Single action, yeah. These are the only ones we have left now. All oh. the other single actions have become obsolete. Unfortunately. Really? Now what what degrees is this? It's about roughly a twenty two. Is it? So let me answer your rod. Kinda it's like your good do all angle. Oh, okay. Yeah, it is. Troll. You can even anchor with it if you really want to. So. You already put me on a 50-pound flathead, so I mean, I can. Yeah, dude, that thing will change your life, dude. Oh, man. <laughs> Let's see it. Once, Let's see. once, you, once you start pulling in on that. There he is himself, I mean, Mr. Steve Dog. The legend. The man, the myth, the legend right here. <laughs> hey, guys. How's hey. Going, nice Good to meet, meet you. you. Nice to meet you. What's your name? Matt. Nice Nick. to meet you, Matt. Nick. Nick? Nice to meet you, Nick. How you doing, man? Watching you for a while. Yeah. Have you? Watching you for a while. Yeah, we, we started them, our own. We get them cool. Uh, oh, this is our channel. Shirts. This is our YouTube our channel. channel. <laughs> I got one. Oh, man, uh, we should have brought some extra. We should have brought one. We'll send you one. Yeah, How about Catfish that? Catfish KC. Yep. Is that uh, your YouTube channel? Yep. Okay. Are yep. we on YouTube now? Yeah. Not live. Okay. Not live. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But I had I had a question sure. for you. I, I was going to see if you ever fished the Kansas River. Yeah. You have? Uh-huh. Any, any good flatheads out of there? Fish Kansas River one time. One time? When I was in here in June. This looking, year. Looking for this place. What did you find? We, we went up there and fished the Kansas River. Uh, he, he went up there. And I went with Eddie Henney and John Berglund. Okay. And we went up to Kansas River for a little while, caught some fish, not nothing big, and then went down to Missouri and did the bumping. Mm -hmm. Caught a few fish. Yeah, Missouri is definitely. Yeah, the boat we have right now. Day, I did go back to the Kansas River somewhere 50 miles that way. And when I got into it, we had to go with a duck, a duck boat. <laughs> yeah, yeah our, our, our boats our boats real flat bottom. Yeah. I mean, in a foot of, a foot of water, I can get through maybe, oh, yeah. but yeah. Yeah, this guy had to get out of the boat, push us through and everything. <laughs> oh, yeah. This year especially, man. Like this year, there's been spots where we almost really? walk across. Oh, yeah. So you set him on this. Wait, that was your first fish? Basically, that was my first real fish. That's a good way to start. <laughs> he, he, he basically, he basically, oh, yeah. he basically. Look at that cheesy horse smile horse. he got. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm looking at the hat. Here you go. Oh, uh, like thanks. Hat. Yeah. Man. You know, I've got channel cat rods too. But 
I use them and I just wear them out and then go get me another sixty nine dollar one as long yeah. as they're available. Yeah. Oh, that's another thing is I was waiting three months, four months Longer to get them. Well, and I then when I saw four there, I'm like, give me all four, yeah. you know. Well, I can do a video about them and they sell out. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, you know, I, I, in the last video I did, I, I, they sent me six and I said, all right, I'm going to put, put it on my reel and do a video. I did. I couldn't go buy no more. Because you did it. You shot yourself in the foot. Yeah. <laughs> I won't do that no more. I buy them first and then I'll do it. <laughs> Didn't, uh, yeah. Was it Chris Flores that said that uh, he, started shoot, he started shooting in his spot over there and then all of a sudden he's got all these people fishing it now. <laughs> so it's like he kind of like he loves that part of the river. You haven't met Chris? I've yeah. not met Chris. Well, come here, Chris. Is he over here? Oh, is he? Yeah, he's here. You guys want to see him? Hey, don't oh. be shy. You mind if we come through? Yeah, come on. Come on, Chris. I know you're taking hey, a break. Ben, do you come mind? On, How's it going? <laughs> 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 Thank you. 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 Me and Chris Flores, no. yeah, the YouTube people, we did YouTube, but they dressed up like me, they roasted. Oh, so you weren't on it? it was I wasn't just, on it. it, it was just made it was other YouTubes like you that imitated me and imitated Chris <laughs> and imitated somebody else. And the lady did me, you know, she cut my, cut my leg out. She had a mustache on and hairy face and all that. And then she did this for Chris. <laughs> You're the one that helps he set up. Oh, yeah. He saved the day. Matt. Matt, yeah, good to meet you, Kevin. Was... Ben. Ben, good Sorry. to meet you, man. It's the MTV Catfish. <laughs> Are you looking on, on uh, YouTube. YouTube now? If it, is it no space or space? It's, it's space. Catfish space, space. Oh. Now, is it like that this on one? there? That's it. Yeah, that's us. Gotcha. Yeah, we appreciate everything you did last year, at least. Uh, I sit and watch it. I mean, watching it. And, yeah. I mean, honestly, that was probably the perfect time to do it too online, like when everyone was online. I mean, it was it was fun to watch, you know, people in their living rooms or in their, you know, it was. <laughs> yeah. Seriously, I learned a lot. I got exposed to so many people I hadn't seen before. I was like, There's new channels that I can watch now. Mm-hmm. But, hey, good to meet you, man. Yeah. You yeah. Just email too, me and we'll, we'll get you set up. All right. Awesome. I appreciate awesome. it. Where are we buying? You guys enjoy your time. Hey. So good, good to meet you. you. I I was like something about you look familiar. I'm like because we just I just watched the video and you were explaining some things, but uh, so how long have you been into catfishing? Well, uh, or is this more kind of like uh, like working with them like business wise? It's just so catfish conference is, is a product from the next year. I mean, it was not meant to be what it is today. Yeah, I actually saw a catfish for the first time. I was overseas. And I saw monsters on the Ohio on National Geographic, and I was like, what is that thing over here? And I thought it was like movie stuff. I said, this is not real. Yeah. Fast forward, I meet my wife, get to the U.S., and um, her uncle is like, hey, we've got a boat dealership. We're sponsoring a guy, Steve Douglas. And like, you know, we want to do something like a conference. I'm like, yeah, sure, about what? It's catfishing. I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> and that's how I actually got into it. Like, we organized that for the first time. They needed help. Ended up doing most of the work. Yeah. And this is where we are. And so since then, I'm involved with this guy, with the company over here, and with um, a bunch of people. So I'm sure they've gotten you on a boat and out yeah. there. Oh, yeah. Got to pull seats. a big one in. <laughs> Secret videos that no one saw. Before. Secret videos? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. What, little bites, no, no fish? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Small things. My daughter gets bigger ones with like a small, like, you know, frozen, you know, yeah. pole. It's <laughs> cool, man. It's, I think I'm more meant to be behind the desk and just helping these guys. <laughs> <laughs> you, you're just like, uh, yeah, this is my purpose. But. Yeah, that's it, exactly. But we appreciate you guys, well, definitely. Thanks again for coming. He was back there eating lunch or something, and I'm like, what the heck? Yeah, he's is back there taking a nap. Yeah, I didn't see his booth here or anything, but. So you are fishing chick? Yes, fishing chick. And that's what it is on YouTube? Uh-huh. Yeah, awesome. no G, fishing. Fish and chick. Yeah, okay. no G. Yeah, because then you I get all I've the girls. Seen, I think I've the, seen. I've heard of it. Yeah. And then you get all the girls in the bikinis, and you got to look at it. Um, right below that, you can see fish and chick without the G. <laughs> with with the bikini or no no bikini? No bikini. <laughs> no. I try to keep it a little more family oriented. <laughs> Good. You're getting you're getting viewers legitly. Okay. Yeah, I try. I try. Right. <laughs> I mean, I, I want to show a little cleavage every once in a while. It's not gonna right. work. It's not gonna work for me. Right. So. Well, I was on Epic Show the other day, and I had a tank top on, and I went back and watched it. Ooh. Listen, you can hear. 
<laughs> no, got it. You get some extra viewers? You owe me $20. No. Actually, I did. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It was a smaller, smaller conference, but um, we got we got to meet Steve Douglas. We got to meet a lot of people we wanted to talk to, down to earth people. That was a fun time, man. It was fun. It was it was inspiring. Got some tips on uh, tips, and actually kind of got fired up a little bit to get out there and start filming and catch some fish. So, um, you know, just being able to see some of the guys that we've been, you know, watching, we've been watching like, for Thomas watching for years. Or, but, Chris Flores. <laughs> Chris Flores. So, yeah, I mean, was, seeing, seeing that was a big, uh, it's it pretty cool just to see, especially, you know, I think about like, if, you, if you've been around watching them for the last two to five years or something, you're like, man, I've seen them kind of grow their channel and grow and yeah. up and kind of. Their personalities are the same as they are on camera. They're, Steve Douglas spent a good I'm 10 to 15 in. minutes with us. Spencer the Spencer from River Certified, he was awesome. Right, Talked to us about, he got to get out on the river yesterday, Missouri River. Um, so awesome experience overall. Hope they come back to Kansas City next year, that'd be awesome. Thank you guys.